Hello everyone, Kevin Carpenter here. Due to a one in a million glitch, the microphone audio for this session was corrupted beyond repair. We had to use the camera audio for this session, and thanks to the audio wizardry of Chris Wrangle, we still have an episode for you today. Apologies for any hums in the background, and rest assured we'll be back to our regular audio setup next session. With that said, let's welcome our newest patrons, Levi Phipps and Aaron Cowley. Thank you so much for your support. And now, on to the show. Rolling in the Mist is a series with fantasy violence, mentions of gore, and worst of all, cussing. Viewer discretion is advised. Welcome everyone to another exciting session of Rolling in the Mist. I, right before I said this, Bravo was doing some weird tongue stuff. And I really hope we're not catching that. Uh, we, oh, we got it. Away. You know what? You know what? Yeah, Bravo, do it real quick for our audience. <laughs> Welcome back to Eden City, folks. Uh, in our last session, our crew managed to make their way onto an active construction site uh, for the Babel Construction Company. Uh, hearing that there is some strange going-ons there, and perhaps something that they could acquire, maybe something criminal they could do, it was kept purposefully vague from uh, by uh, uh, Minerva, one of the people working for the Olympus family, who gave that lead to our Mafia heiress, uh, Corey here, who called up her uh, various freelancers and are now in the middle of a job. They managed to get onto the active construction site by being incredibly honest about <laughs> their endeavors. Poor honest thieves. <laughs> you guys are the most honest thieves. <laughs> um, we, we do crime. Don't love me. Please Man. don't love me in this. <laughs> like, you get a job activation. Crime. And while uh, Marty, Corey, and Leland were talking with uh, Foreman Hammond, um, our fourth member of the crew, uh, Logan, uh, managed to bluff his way onto the construction elevator all the way to the top floor of this skyscraper still being under construction and managed to come face to face with uh, Donald Masterson, uh, one of the new people in the construction crew and apparently one of their best uh, as Logan witnessed him take a sledgehammer and uh, hit something so hard it uh, burst with uh, this blue and white energy and glowed with these mysterious runes that instantly caught Logan's eye. Can I add something before you start? Uh, that the thing he smacked in was like a rivet that oh, takes a machine to like pound multiple times and that he did it in one thrust? Yeah. This, this, this dude, of course, I'm like, my character's stonewall, but it's like... He hit, <laughs> he hit this rivet, got it in one go, and the blast was enough to do, like, a thunderclap. Yeah. Like, literally, your ears are yeah. ringing now. This dude... Oops, sorry. Can I, my mic stop? <laughs> Everyone stop hitting the mic. Yeah. <laughs> I got hard. I'm doing Ow. all this hand stuff, and there's mics everywhere. Let me tell you something. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, you saw those runes that caught you interested. But yeah, no, this dude is uh, crazy strong and uh, almost... That was even funnier not being able to see his face and just Who is that <laughs> motherfucker that did not <laughs> put their phone on silent? Chris, please uh, put your phone on the couch or another surface. Okay, you know what? Your ass. Ass. Be honest, be honest, I'd rather take that than the snoring. <laughs> Sorry! So, uh, what are gonna... you today, Ar? Do, uh, should we do that? Should we? Uh, yeah, we're still recapping. Yeah, well, I'm still doing yeah. it. I'm, uh, still, I'm, not, I'm switching. Do we, uh, do, you know what? Fuck it, fuck it, fuck it. Follow. Follow. Not a Who's joining us? Who's joining us? Follow. <laughs> Join us. Where, who are you? <laughs> oh, tell us. Tell us now. Hi, hi, hi there, everybody. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm <laughs> Pablo. I'm Pablo Mia. I'm, I'm playing. Uh, I'm playing. Who, who, who am I playing? Who am I playing, right? Oh, right. Uh, who, who, who am I playing? Uh, gosh, gosh, it's every every episode we do this. Every episode we do this is so stupid. Why don't we just write it down? We write down everything else. We're writing everything else, guys. Well, why, 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 why do we want to write this out? I'm playing Marty Blanc. <laughs> wow. Color sales. <laughs> and the face. He has one. I'm Jason. I'm Leland Myers. I'm Bravo. Oh. I'm playing Logan Herrera. <laughs> 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 so, so gingerly. <laughs> 
Did we Sorry. hear you? Sorry. No, no, I already finished. Go oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I saw like that. <laughs> that was cool. <laughs> Hey guys, it's Chris. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to be playing Kare, Kare Vidalis. I'm an heiress for a crime family. Who's very out in the open? <laughs> Fantastic. Very, very open about that, that history, that occupation. Uh, we're going to start right where we uh, left last session off. Um, Marty, Leland, and Corey, you guys have been uh, escorted off of the uh, active construction site after, uh, you know, Foreman, he answered however many questions he was willing to uh, answer. Uh, so, you know, still, like, wearing your hard hats, you guys have been brought to, like, the fence perimeter. Um, and uh, after a, a sort of tense situation, you guys are sort of uh, hanging outside the fence when you hear another thunderclap overhead. And uh, before we get into the uh, situation proper, uh, Marty, what's going through your mind for this voiceover monologue? I don't know why I let myself get lumped into these situations with these miscreants. My father taught me better, raised me to be a man of magnitude, told me to be upright, uppercut, smart, sharp, straight and narrow. Here I am. Oh crap, here I am. I can't take too long here, he needs me. Oh, did I, but, oh shit, did I leave the salmon out to thaw? I need to remember to do that every time I leave, otherwise he'll have to cook for himself and then, I promise him he never have to cook for himself. Okay, I, anyway, I gotta get out of here. This kid's a good kid at heart, I know she is, but I'll be damned if she keeps using these damn feminine wiles to keep pulling me deeper into the mud. I hope I left the curling iron on. I mean, I don't did it. <laughs> Another thunderclap breaks your uh, breaks your thoughts. What well, that was that? <laughs> as you guys um, make it outside the construction site and are kind of gathered around your car once again, uh, and there is uh, one person. Uh, Wait, uh, we got kicked off the whole. Yeah, that's why I was. I thought we were just one here. Like, what the fuck? He, so Foreman Hammond. Uh, he what didn't guards wanna... does this guy have? Yeah, Foreman Hammond. Basically, here's the situation. You guys were talking to him, and then at a certain point, things got a little bit tense. Mm -hmm. uh, so he answered some questions, but basically, like, if you guys have no further business here, I'd like to get off my site. Uh, so pretty much, like, there is like some. There's like a construction worker who's like, uh, screw it. I already got a character. Donnie. Donnie came back with glasses. Um, <laughs> yes. and, uh, he's like, just kind of holding the glasses, not really knowing what to do as you guys, as he's escorting you like off the construction site, I assume you have the rosé in your hand yes. already. Um, so yeah, so you guys are being led toward the fences. You know, there's like an escort with you. If you guys want to try something while you're being led to the fences, <laughs> you can do that. But you know, th there's a bunch of construction workers around you. This is an active site. So if you try anything, things could go bad. You're still wearing the hard hats. We are still wearing our hard hats, mm -hmm. and um, but we're like back out in front of the fence now. With yeah. Hard hats. You're in the yard, right? Yeah, yeah. you got okay. But we're not in his office in the yard. Yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. that's in so the much yard. better. We're at a crossroads. We either leave, leave, or we go. Down. We try to go where he's at. Well, but you guys we, don't know. We don't know. That's what I was gonna say. Well, you know what I'm saying. We got Logan. Look for you. Mm -hmm. right. So we um, notice Logan's gone. Yeah, you guys get uh, near like the edge of the fencing, like before you're getting taken out. I rewind what I said earlier about you guys being outside the yard. <laughs> okay. uh, I want to give you guys the opportunity to do stuff. Uh, you guys are still in the yard when, as you're being escorted out by Donnie, uh, you yeah. look around and uh, you see that Logan is nowhere to be seen. And and the foreman's back in his office. So foreman's just, back in. His we're office. not being escorted. We're just Donnie. Donnie, Donnie, is, Donnie is escorting, escorting us. Okay, uh, hang on, guys. We gotta find Lo we gotta find Logan. Uh, you know, I was feeling like our group was a little short. <laughs> uh, 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 all right. Well, uh, hey, hey, kid. Uh, Donnie looks over. He goes, ah, "What? I'm, I'm, I'm 35." Kid, have you seen our associate? Yeah, that's right. <laughs> I use my. <laughs> Look over there, <laughs> and then when he then I, some like silver, <laughs> some silver wings, like Polly, he's like, yes. now look at me. Huh. Yeah, now you tell me. <laughs> oh <my laughs> now you tell me. Have you, you seen our associate anywhere? You got more square chin. I got more, <laughs> got more square chin. I'm holding one of those. Uh, what is he? That the tanning thing that he oh. has. Oh. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> now, have you seen our associate? I like flash the sun at him a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't he's like, he's like. Donnie is so freaked out. He's just like, oh, no, 
Where'd he go? Where'd he go? You look at me, kid. You look at me. Huh? Grab him. Oh, <laughs> I just grab him the arms and get him up. give us a tour of this facility until we find our missing little muskrat. Otherwise, crack your knuckle with one hand. <laughs> <laughs> You're directing him out of his And I am biting my teeth so you start seeing one crack. Oh, oh <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> you get the... Jesus Christ. <laughs> you get the picture... Yeah, I mean, I can, I can, I can, I can kind of lead, I can lead you around just as long as you're you're near me and all that. But I don't, I don't know what you know. I just drop him. Oh, just, <laughs> I don't have to convince or anything. This is great. It's so <laughs> he's he, he's he's so fucking scared. Still <laughs> for no, no. first no. interaction, I think. Today was his first day. Today will be his last day. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't do as I Donnie say. Is. Yeah. Because he, here's the thing: you guys canonically know that Donnie was not in on the criminal gang before. He's, yeah. He's, so he, so he, he was originally work. like, "All right, easy gig. You know, security around the construction site. Who wants to break in? Hi there. We're with it. We're with this very big mafia family. Oh, fuck. Welcome <laughs> to the underworld. <laughs> <laughs> it's all welcoming. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so yeah, he's 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 like, yeah, I, I can take you around like the the yard and all that. I mean, I can't like. I, I, Hopefully he's around the yard. If, if he went onto the construction site, that's like that's like real bad. That'd be really bad, yeah. wouldn't it? Yeah. So uh, yeah, I mean I can just oh, kind of. Daddy, can I call you Daddy? That's my name. Yes. Well, the way I see it, it might be a good idea if you go back to your post, and we'll handle whatever we need to until it's time to go. So that I'm gonna need a persuasion, okay? Um, because yeah. well, persuade, convince, yeah. Yeah. to help I'm, out, I'm, I'm to help crossing out. over yeah, 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 yeah. No, I'm gonna need can, a Can uh, we convince. bribe Donnie, or do we have no money? You have <laughs> money on you. Can I show him a body part I took from someone? <laughs> <laughs> let let, let oh, Corey do oh, oh, uh, her thing first. Well, okay, because I, I I really want to use my death sense, like my my ring thing. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Um. Mm -hmm. So when I'm saying that, can I have like caressed his arm to like <laughs> to try to use the <laughs> ring to see if like there's anything that I can pair with what I said of like, okay, I know how you're gonna die, kind of a thing, Ooh. as part of the intimidation. So here's what I'm gonna do. Okay. Uh, if you want to <laughs> gleam into his life using your magic powers. To to see when he's gonna die. That's gonna be an entirely separate role. Oh, okay. So uh, let's do let's do that as an investigation. What tags are you gonna use to investigate the day he dies? Okay, okay. So he missed. It's like yeah. 20 minutes from now. <laughs> <laughs> Meanwhile, he's getting the shit kicked out of him up there one time before he's dying. Um, okay, I'm like, is there any way I can work around this? If this doesn't go well, I might try to bluff. So I don't know I how mean, I want to add. Oh, oh okay, like... so then that would be Death Sense and just like, uh, I don't know, either, either Angelic Persona or Mouse of Babes to try to do like a, if whatever I find out, I could still bluff on it? I don't know. Uh, you're you're kind of doing like an intimidation here thing, but oh, also it's still separate. Okay. Yeah, it's it's still kind of like a thing there where you're like, hey, I've got all these people, and also you know like this reputation. Like you better do what I say if you know what's yeah. good for you. Okay. Okay. Uh, well then I guess I'll, I'll just try the death sense. I just really want to try it. Okay. okay. That's a seven eight. and eight. Okay. Uh, so yeah, so that's one tag, so that's one clue. Uh, when's he gonna die? Uh, you touch him mm -hmm. and your ring that's mm -hmm. still around your finger. Mm -hmm. uh, My it does, ring. It doesn't glow, but it begins to feel very cold. Mm. Uh, for both you and him, uh, as you suddenly see an image of your mind of uh, Donnie. Uh, he's, he's grown a beard. Apparently, this is some years uh, later. Uh, he's gotten a little bit more confident with himself. You see that you know he's like telling people. So apparently, he got a promotion, and uh, he's on this like girder, and he's like looking up, being like, "All right, so you just got wait, wait, no, no." And then you hear as as something breaks and a like ton of like full metal wow. material Ooh. falls right on top of Done. it. Done. Snapped right back out. Okay, okay. So uh, having seen that and having my, my arm on his- he, you're, He's looking at you, he's like, your hand is really cold, man. <laughs> <laughs> the sweet pot. You've been so very helpful today and I would love to return the favor. I think you're um, up and coming in this line of work, and I would love for you to reach your goals without any interruptions. Um, I think the key for you to remember here mm -hmm. is mm -hmm. that to move up in this line of business, 
is to maintain good relationships. And also, I would be very careful if you end up being told to work up on that top, uh, <laughs> top rail up here. So, <laughs> so, so now give me the convince. Okay. Um, I'm gonna give you a plus one on that just because of how creepy that was. <laughs> <laughs> um, I like how specific is specifically right there. <laughs> Don't be right there. Right. Um, so would that be Olympic goons? Um, my dog's still there and infernal yeah. guard dog? Yeah, they're all still there, yeah. Okay. There. Um, would I still do mouths of babes for that one? Uh, yeah, you're, it's it's almost like even more intimidating at that point. Oh, okay, so it's not so much the, the angelic God, look, it's, yeah, it's the... Fucking yeah, fucking uh, okay. Once again, though, using that uh, weakness tag. Okay, okay, so I, it would just be the two, then. You better go this hard on, like, the harder bosses. <laughs> We're doing this to civilians. <laughs> That's cocked. Uh, <sighs> really right cocked one. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> so it was a four, a two, a six, plus two uh, more, right? Plus two, yeah. Uh, so, so that's eight. an eight. Eight? Okay. Another eight. Yeah. Um, I love that you perfectly nailed the other one. Yeah, I, like, <laughs> I don't like that role. It's very core, We do both. <laughs> um, yeah, he looks at you and looks over at the girder you pointed at. Still looks, smiling. It's like... Sip. Hi. Okay, I, I'm 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 really gonna hate saying this, but uh, yeah, I, I, I can I can bring you around, you know, to, to, to find your friend. You know, of course it would be really bad if, if I just escorted you know some of you out. Um, but I I and he, you you can tell he's really he really hates what he's about to say next. Mm -hmm. I, I I still gotta accompany you all to, to find him and then yeah, lead you sense. out. I, 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 still, I still gotta be with you. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. That's, that's, I'm gonna be in even more trouble if I just leave. You. <laughs> and I just stop breaking. <laughs> that's fine, that's fine, buddy. One handed still? Like, just... <laughs> oh, yeah, no, no, no. Like, like, or, like, are I... you breaking the knuckles that are like holding him? No, no, no. I let him go. Okay. I let him go. Oh, now right, I'm just right, doing right. this. Like, alright. <laughs> I'm going to let you like step forward. I'm just going to turn slightly and just sit while he's still like. You're still babbling. sipping on the rose. <laughs> it's, it's the Kermit meme. It's the Kermit yeah. meme. We're just like. I, okay, so I stand in front of Donnie just looking down. I was like, where do you think my friend would have gone? And with that. We, uh... Meanwhile... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait Yes. And like, like, it's just you, and you're like... <laughs> 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 Don't die! Alright, like, oh, yeah, so here we go. We're at the top of the skyscraper. <laughs> there are girders and, uh, some floors already, uh, built, as well as some, like, you know, like, the cheap walls here and there, but like the bare bones of construction to be able to like actually like walk around. There's no walls. So outside you see like you're you're real high up. Uh, outside you see like the city itself stretching far, the industrial district, uh, the blue collar residential zone, all the different like power plants, you know, like belching smoke into the air and all the different parks that like uh, spread out with greenery. Just a city of many different faces. But the face that you're most focused on and worried about is the face of, uh, you actually didn't catch this nope. name, um, but uh, you, you see the face of like a large man uh, who the audience knows is Donald Masterson. Uh, and he's carrying this like huge sledgehammer and you just saw him like hit a rivet, which normally takes like a machine to hit. And he did it in one strike doing this like huge thunderclap. And as he, like, lifts back his sledgehammer and the light, like, disperses from it, and, like, you know, you can still kind of see the runes, but, it, like, there's nothing lighting them up. They're just carved into the sledgehammer. And you are noticing that those runes look familiar when uh, Donald turns to you and goes, Oh, wait, uh, I, haven't, uh, I haven't seen you around here before. Uh, he he walks right up to you and like yeah this, this, this is like this is these are like fragile like construction like just so our guys can walk floors uh, so there is definitely some shaking as he comes up to you uh, holding the sledgehammer over his massive like brick wall shoulders and goes like oh hey uh, what you new here uh, and I look I look I look at the hammer I'm still keeping eyes on those ruins look back at him I look down at my uh, my, my chart mm -hmm. and he's like. Yes, uh, I'm one of the new engineers up here. I was just trying to see the progress of the building. Yeah. I can see you're doing a fantastic job. That was quite the mighty swing you just did there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, no, uh, ever since uh, the construction, you know, I, I, I got this uh, sledgehammer, and uh, ever since, you know, I, I've been doing uh, real good with it, you know? 
I mean, I've been, uh, we've, all this work around here, you see, you know, like a bunch of rivets everywhere. And each rivet, you can, I mean, I'm gonna give you this one for free. Each rivet has just a bit of like burn around it. And the smell and the smell, even though like there's no walls here, from the blast that you just saw, there is still a smell of ozone everywhere. Ooh. God damn. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, but Donald, this this guy, he's he's got like a smile on his face. He's yeah, like happy, I'll go look. Can, yeah. Can Donald sound like Sylvester Stallone? Oh my god. Can you uh, be Sylvester Stallone? Yeah, That's what I mean. Can he be here? Gotta go what you gotta do. <laughs> That's how winning is done. That's how winning is done. Yeah, 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 all right, all right. That's so your get into it phrase. Yeah. <laughs> that's how win. Yeah, that's my that's my get into it. Yeah, hang on. Cut the cameras real quick. I need to get into it. Okay. That's how winning is done. There we go. I'm in the do you want us to say. bring out yeah, some meat for you just like yeah. lunch yeah. for a while? <laughs> Sometimes it's a little slower than that. You just put some gum in there. <laughs> No, see, that's, that's what I do for Otis. I have to. You're do, right, you're yeah. right. Anyway, uh, so yeah, so Donald Masterson, who he coughs real quick and goes into his regular voice. <laughs> anyway, uh, what do you. So, uh, oh, you so see, you want the. Yeah, we're doing uh, real good here. Don't have to worry about that. Me and my uh, my trusty sledge here. We're, uh, you know, we're doing a good job here. So you just keep uh, making the plans and telling me where to hit, and I'll keep hitting them. <laughs> yeah, it's, a, it's, a, it's a pleasure to meet you. I'm, uh, I'm Logan. Oh, nice to meet you, Logan. Hey, uh, yeah, be careful around here, by the way. You know, it's like, uh, yeah, I, sometimes I, I can't control how hard I hit. <laughs> oh, <man. laughs> I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, don't worry, I have my earplugs. Uh, I, I have to say, like, you said you were given this head sl slash hammer. Did uh, the company here give it to you? Because I know most <laughs> construction workers bring their own equipment from time to time. <laughs> Oh yeah, I mean like, you know, uh, I, I came in and you know, there was like the tools from the construction company itself. So like, you know, I, I didn't have a sledgehammer when I first started. So I came in, I grabbed one and you know what? I've been using this one ever since. I actually, uh, I bought it off the construction company. You know, they, this, oh. yeah, this was the sledgehammer that they were just like giving out to people. I'm like, you know what? This fits me. Yeah. <laughs> and, and, and I look at his imposing fucking stature. Yeah. I'm like, he really does bring the whole picture together. <laughs> I was like, um, I mean, I'm also looking around for like, this is my first time working on this project. Um, the company that you said you bought it from, like, what, what, what was the company? Babel Construction, the people like working here, man. No, like Babel Construction, you bought it off of Babel Construction. Yeah, this is just one of the tools that they had, like, just in case, you know, in case, like, people don't like, you know, like, have their own tools and all that, or, like, tool breaks, you know. I found this in the, you know, the lot that they had there with the rest of the tools, and like I said, I bought it off them. Wow, how much you how much you pay for it? You don't mind me asking. Uh, he kind of like gives you a look. He's like, well, you know, I I I, I think I know where you're going with this. This such ain't for sale. It's all mine. <laughs> and he, uh, <laughs> I, I kind of like. <laughs> 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 That's it. Well, don't worry, sir. Uh, in my standing, as I look up at him, it's like I don't think I'll be able to wield it. What I'm more curious about. Wouldn't you kind of be kind of curious? I mean, as an engineer myself, I, I my job is to understand how things work, you know, in modern common sense. You're a very strong man. I can respect that. I actually have a very good friend who's uh, just as big as you. Oh! A whole different persona. That's you know, cheery, but he has his soft spots. <laughs> it's like, how were you able to, with just this hammer, and I point to the, the most recent uh, ribbon, crank one of those straight into the ground and leave it a bit of a smoking mess. Uh, he gives you a smile and a wink and he goes, I'll work real hard. Now, if you excuse me, I gotta get back to work. But it's great meeting you, uh, Logan? Logan. What's your name? Uh, Donald. Donald. Donald Masterson. And he, he extends a hand yeah. out, he has to reach down. It, <laughs> it's entirely yeah. class your hand. And said, he's like, actually, before you leave. Uh, yeah, he's, I, he's like mid-turn. Yeah, and I take off my, my jacket. <laughs> and I show him uh, the the rune tattoos that I have, oh. and I said, "What are these uh, symbols doing on your hammer?" If you don't mind me asking. He stops and he like takes a look and he looks at the <laughs> stuff on the shit. Huh. You know what? I I never really uh, never really thought about it before, but uh, you know, I just thought it was like the the brand or something. Like that. What what are those? Uh, I mean, do I have to roll for this? Because I can read runes. What do those runes on yeah, no, you say? Yeah, you, you have a tag for reading runes, yeah. so I'm just going to honor the tag here. Uh, yeah, I mean, the the runes read Mjolnir. 
and I'm, I don't I don't show anything. I'm just like it's like as you could tell, I'm a huge fan of you know Norse mythology. Oh, oh, it's like, oh, what, oh yes. wait, wait, what is that? Yes. Uh, so with this, uh, and I put it down. It's like that is the the name of uh, Sons of Evolve. Oh. Have you ever heard of that story? No. Oh. Uh, long story short, they were a dwarven family that created a magical, enchanted weapons, gear, equipment for the gods. And oh, okay. I took notice of your family's tab. Don't get me wrong, I'm not trying to buy it. Or yeah, no, I, I mean, I see where the brand comes from. You, yeah, know, no, you, you, right you definitely want a brand uh, with, with that kind of thing. Yeah. It's like, do you mind if I just take a look a little closer? Don't worry. I just kind of want to look at I'm, I'm, this, I'm sorry, but uh, not no. Nah, this this is my tool. You know, you got your tools. They points toward your blueprints. You know, you you got your thinking tools. This this is my tool. Uh, I don't like to be touching it. Let's see. Well, I mean, as an engineer, I, I would have to then report any possibilities of problems that may cause damage to the building. And as good work as you're doing, sir, I do have to be aware of anything that might try to throw any of the schematics off scale because. If you don't notice, smashing a rivet into a building and making a loud noise isn't exactly normal. It's hard working, right? mm -hmm. wrong. He's like, but that's something I will have to report. <laughs> okay, so you're trying to like blackmail him a little mm -hmm. bit. Give me a give me a convince roll here. So I'm gonna use I for detail. Okay. Uh, okay. And master engineer. All right. <laughs> and gun. And gun. <laughs> Dude, he's like right in front of me. I don't have quick draw on that shit. Uh, <laughs> so that's it's like, okay. Six, seven, eight, nine. Nice. Nine. Okay. Uh, Did I mention the gun? <laughs> <laughs> no, I, have, I can't. Again, he's right in front of me. He's like, He'll no. Step on him. Yeah. Build a so, bag on him. Yeah. <laughs> So oh, here's the deal, actually. I'm, I'm going to get a little uh, meta here. So, uh, City of Mist, yeah, City of Mist, uh, you know, like persuading people, convincing yeah. people and all that, sometimes it's not a, uh, sometimes it's not a one roll fits all. Sometimes it's just like combat where you got to, uh -oh. you know, yeah. wear them down. So instead of him uh, going along with it and, you know, keeping his own priority in order, instead you're going to give him a status. How many uh, tags did you hit? Two. Him? Two. Uh, so Donald Masterson has a, uh, Convinced to status, uh, and you can see like his eye. Job drop. security too. His, his, <laughs> uh, yeah, job, job security too. That's his status. <laughs> job security too is what he's been hit with, and his eyebrow twitches. Um, but you see that he's not fully convinced as he leans down, oh, oh. towering over you, and goes. What else is there? Want to say that again? clutching the sledgehammer in his grip. So here's the deal. You can continue to try to convince him, but uh, once, you know, like with every move in City of Mist, you're opening yourself up to consequences. Of course. And also, uh, with City of Mist, you can't do the exact same move twice. So if you want to try to convince him, you're going to have to come at it from another angle this time. The gun. <laughs> use the gun. I know you have a gun somewhere. <laughs> so I can't, I can't use the same power tags? You can't you you basically you can't do the exact same thing. Is is what we're getting at. So like you know, let's say you have a power attack for like fireball, like in a fight, you throw a fireball once. You can't for your next move throw the exact same fireball. You gotta do something right different. Right? It's just a, it's a city less thing. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> let, me, let, me, uh, let me try something else. Uh, okay. Um. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, okay. Oh god. Okay, we don't want to do this. I said uh, as he's towering over me, I said he's like, well, uh, sir. I don't know if you have uh, earplugs. Maybe the loud crashing may have blown out of the ear. Um, <laughs> what I, <laughs> he's like, what I meant to say is that I have to report anything that might be a problem. And this is for your safety as well as the building's safety. Yes, you're a very overbearing individual, just like my friend is. He's like, but in order to make sure that the building stays fine, as well as your job security, I have to take a look at that. Okay, uh, so it's gonna be another convince what uh, tax you're so gonna what I'm gonna, more serious um, with this. Yeah, so um, actually, let, let me finish more of the conversation. Cool, go for it, go for it, go for it. And it's just like, for example, if you were to hit the wrong divot in the wrong place, that will send a crack down the foundation of the entire building, and you could kill millions. I don't know what that you can kill your entire crew. Oh, you think I can't do my job, old man? There's always possibilities for error and everything. Okay. Now, not only that, Given how hard you, you were able to land the hit on these things, leaving it smoldering, what if there's some sort of difference in the metal that the rivet you put in, you melted the wrong way? 
you did your job effectively. But something like this could cause problems for you that you didn't intend. Now, I'm going to use master engineering knowing how buildings work okay. Okay. and an eye for detail given specifically about the metal that they're using and it melting could possibly cause a structural damage. Okay, you're coming at this from another angle, yeah. so all out, let's go. Five, six. <laughs> eight again. <laughs> I feel like only eights have been rolled yeah. this whole time. Yeah. It's not good, but it's not yeah. bad. It's, it's not bad, but it's not yeah. bad. I'll take an eight, jeez. Um, <laughs> What's the highest you've done? Six? Okay, okay. No, no, no. I think it was a nine. So, uh, sorry, so that was two tax once again? Yes. Okay. That's uh, another two status. He went from job security to to uh, job uh, uh, lawsuit. Job. Yeah. <laughs> lawsuit anxious <laughs> three. Anxious just law. Just investor three. liability. Yeah. <laughs> That's the investor liability. <laughs> <laughs> Donald looks at you. He goes, "I'm a reasonable man." Okay. And uh, he. <laughs> Without the fire changing in his eyes, he gives a smile and stands up and goes, You got a good point. So, foreman comes up to me, talks to me about my hammer, safety practices. I'll talk to him about it. But, uh, for right now, though, I still need to get more work done. You see that he is shaken. He is, like, actively thinking about what you're talking about. But I'm, I'm going to give you this. Each time he said something, his hammer glowed just slightly. Mm. And you get a sense that there's like, there might be something more to him wanting to hold on to the hammer rather than just job security. That said, you are you are close. If you yeah. want to, if you have anything else to try and convince him, feel free. Um, <laughs> but as you're thinking about that, I feel like this is the perfect time yeah, for you to hear oh. the elevator behind you uh, coming up. And sure enough, you see uh, four figures, three who you are very familiar <laughs> with. Can we have a quick elevator conversation sure. with Donnie? Sure. Mm -hmm. uh, camera rolls down. <laughs> the elevator is coming up. You guys are seeing all the different floors pass by you. As the other side of the elevator, you see the city uh, stretching out. My hand is on Donnie's head. It's like it's just, <laughs> I'm, I'm playing good spot. And we've already, we've already, we, the only place we know is like Masterson top. That's where, yeah. that's where the sounds come from. So we told him to take us there. Yeah. We, yeah. we, we would probably know that. Pre that's where Logan would have gone. Pretty much during the time of the conversation, you guys did enough like looking around the yard to realize like he's not here. And yeah. the slamming can be heard yeah, exactly. everywhere. So that's probably where you went. Oh um, my gosh, I was just really, since we're going no higher, problem. I wonder if Donnie's getting more worried because I did already mention, like, if you ever find oh! yourself up there, like, be careful. His, his eyes, so here's the thing, he's super anxious as the elevator's going up and his eyes are, like, on the girder as, like, Leland is, like, leaving <laughs> handprints in his hard hat. Like it is, it's it's firm, but I, well, I'm okay because yeah. it, I have a strong grip. Yeah, I, I imagine just like slight cracking, maybe just a little <laughs> indenting. Uh, and his eyes are like looking at the girder that you pointed out, which is about like halfway up. And then the elevator passes it, and he's like, he's just watching it. You pass it, he goes. <laughs> <laughs> he's still nervous. He's still nervous, um, but at least he gets that breath. Do we know from his mob connects or your? I don't know what was exactly. It wasn't really specified. Do we know the family? No. The we, we do know, business we, with them. We, but like, you don't know who they are? The Babylon uh, ba company is kind oh, of like Babylon. a vendor. Yeah, Babylon. The Babylon, Babylon the company, yeah. Babylon's the family? Uh, no, 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 no. Babylon's there is no Babylon family. family. Stop, stop, no Babylon. Oh, okay. uh, it's B-A-B-L uh, construction, Babel construction, oh, okay. building to the heavens. Uh, right. They are their own company that works with crime families as both a like money laundering scheme, scheme slash insurance fraud scheme. But there's no family that owns Babel. Exactly. Uh, They're not a subsidiary of the Olympus family. There are people that deal with the Olympus family. Like a vendor. As well as some other, you know, like crime. But yeah. there was no family... I'm trying to see what. See, because the thing is, most families would own the business. That's why they would be doing mm -hmm. this. Yeah. Stuff. So I wondered, it, this particular building. Do we know which family commissioned the construction of this building? Ooh, that very mm -hmm. interesting. Right, you know, uh, Jason That's has a point that they're not really working with them. They work underneath the family. Like the casinos were something like that. Yeah. What yeah. you were doing. I, most con 
because most mob things, the, the mobs had a hand in the construction. That's why they would always be able to threaten them with like a like a union strike and all that stuff. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It, That's it's, how it normally it's, it's a similar thing to the casinos where it's like, you know, they have like their stakes in it, but also like Babel Construction is one that works with multiple mob families. This is why you aren't able to just be like, you know, Walk this, in, yeah, yeah, this isn't why the Olympus family are able to just go in and take whatever they want because the Olympus just deals with them every now and then. Give me an investigation check. You're on an elevator, so your options are limited. If you have any power tags uh, related to like underworld relations like Leland have, you know, now would be the time for them. Otherwise, it'll just be a plus zero. Watch crime films. <laughs> I was going to say, like, this is a nice little free lesson we're getting here. <laughs> Here's how to exploit all, your work. All those shows of Mafia and all that. Wait, I'm doing an investigation coming based <laughs> just talking to these two or I'm doing this with Donnie? I mean, it, really, like I said, it's your it's your power tags to determine how you're like looking into He's stuff. He's asking you how do you want it. How do you want to find this information? I'm playing with the dog, so I think it's just you talking. I, I imagine, I think these two would know more than I would. I'm what, I'm, what I'm trying to get at is I'm trying to get information on a specific family, a specific matriarch or patriarch, whoever leads that family. So that I and then see if so we have an image of them somewhere, maybe on your phone or so, I don't know where you would uh, online if they're famous enough to be like online, so that I could impersonate well, them. So here's the thing: that's going to be a lot easier when you're like you know at your home or whatever, and you're able to like go on yeah, the yeah, internet yeah, yeah. and like yeah, get yeah, yeah. stuff, like actually like investigate. You're on an elevator right now, or if I already know that, but it happens to be someone that I yeah. know. Yeah, yeah that, that's what I'm saying. Out. If you have tags that are like already for underworld connections, then you know it could be like okay. if you already knew them, like Leland did. Oh, the only thing I have that's useful in that uh, department is omniscient wisdom. Oh, what I know. You, what? Have, a, you have omniscient wisdom. I have omniscient yeah. wisdom. So then let's. Do that, uh, that's the perfect act for it. Okay. Plus one. Right? Yeah. So real quick before you roll, what does tapping into? Because uh, Marty hasn't shown off a whole lot of his powers yet. Mm-hmm. What is tapping into omniscient wisdom work Marta? and feel like oh. for for Marty? Screaming in agony. <laughs> in the middle of the, the, middle of the elevator. Ah! Ah! This is space. It's the all right. It's obviously a quiet thing. It's not like a very uh, flashy sort of thing. But I think that while he's got his hand on his hard hat and she's doing exactly what she's doing, <laughs> mm-hmm. just like she always does, mm-hmm. I'm standing oh, behind them oh, or in the floor or background um, with myself, just gathering every, all the information I heard from the foreman. Uh, what she's, what you know, off off mic, off cam, that maybe uh, Corey has mentioned, what you've mentioned about your mob connections, if you've recognized anyone in the yard who are doing a day job, yeah. whatever they call it on the yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, uh, they call it something else. Yeah, yeah, but you know what I'm talking about. So, you know, I'm gathering all this information, trying to put two and two together. You know, the way you put that, I'm almost kind of imagining like uh, like BBC Sherlock when you look at someone and there's, yes, yes, there's yes, just yes, all yes. these different little details. It's that like limitless. So I was getting what it actually yeah. looks like is yeah. it's me. And yeah. because this is part of my magical trickster, part of the the Kamiho, uh, uh myth, I'm, you know, the the Camillo is not just one. There's multiple kinds of them and all. <laughs> and so it's like my eyes would probably glow white as I close them, and then you would go into like this. You know, um, music of like, sort of like synapses it in my brain, like colorful, like. Have you ever seen that? Right hook. Have you ever seen that meme where shows like guys face like this, and then just shows equations? Yes, Zach Galifianakis. Yes, Zach Galifianakis is putting those two and two together, but instead of equations, it's like. It's like people's faces, uh, news headlines, uh, things uh, people have said. Yeah. Just <laughs> her mouth, iron. just his mouth saying Just putting things. the pieces yeah. together. Yeah. People yeah. in the yard, faces, images, all, all together. Spot and panting. It's, and it's not just, but the <laughs> images are not coming just from what I've seen and heard. It's from what every lifetime of every oh. Camino has seen and heard along That's their right. adventures throughout ah. time. That's what makes it omniscient. Ah. Yeah. Is I'm tapping into the history of the traveling uh, You're going fox, into the Avatar foxes state, I yeah. of all time. I imagine yes. that's very helpful to uh, to sell cars to people. Yes. Yeah. All right. Let's yeah, roll yeah, for yeah, it. Yeah. So. Yeah. So it's a plus one. <laughs> so it's a plus. So it's a plus one. Yeah. <laughs> it's beautiful. All right. All right. Here we go. Here we go. That's right, what right, right, here we got. Here we got one. Big money. Big money. Big money. Big money. Big. Hey. It's seven. Seven. It's seven. Barely escaping a failure. Still a mixed success. Lower middle class. All right. <laughs> <laughs> All righty. So, what? I- give me the question. Where on earth is Carmen Sandiego? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> She's looking for what? Uh, the question for Donnie or yeah. for you? Yeah. Well, what is the question that you want to know? What, you have one clue. What's his deal? 
Fucking ass. What's his fucking problem? Yeah. Even though he doesn't know that, you know, before us, he didn't know that he was working for a crime syndicate. I want to know, not from Donnie, I just want to know what, who's the crime boss who commissioned this building? Okay. Can we save that and use it after our whole little thing we're about to do up on the floor? Because that's something you could Well, if I use, we're going to see the foreman again. Yeah. Exactly. Do you want yeah. to just save it? I, I want to know it because it might be useful against Masterson or the foreman or both. So if I can get both. Mm, that's what you're saying. So I just want to know this. I think the, the problem. The more we know, the sooner the better. But here's the problem. We only have one person. It's either Donnie mm -hmm. or you have to ask us. I mean, if anything, Donnie would know just like a name of who commissioned it, but he wouldn't know if they're actually connected. It would be up to us to know. Well, if I wouldn't even know because he wasn't. He, he has no ties to the to the crime. But he might know a but name. Like, yeah, so just a name. He doesn't. Yeah. Because yeah. yeah. I mean, like, if you're working for it, be like, oh yeah, they 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 ordered this building from us. We're just gonna. So then let me ask you this then. And sorry. Do you want to waste it on Donnie when we can use that for the form? Well, here's the thing. I can still use it for the form. Yeah, I he, have he, he has his right, he's using his omniscient wisdom. Oh, this okay. is yeah, yeah, never mind, never mind. So here's Sorry, the deal. Yeah. With your mixed success, uh, you are like tapping into this ability and like all these different things are like appearing in front of you. Equations, different details, all the different little details that most people never notice, but you do to get a full picture of everything going on. Uh, and as you're just, as you're trying to get a name for this building, you get one as you as the elevator lifts up high enough that you can see past the building on the horizon and see a billboard <laughs> helix slabs that snaps me out of it i go logan the trouble <laughs> <laughs> meanwhile helix uh, labs yes meanwhile, uh, here's the thing roof. here here's the thing so uh, this is still a mixed success, so I'm gonna okay. throw I'm gonna throw one thing at you. This I get a headache. A bird poops in you. I get it. <laughs> you also see something else. Uh, you see the Helix Labs billboard, and you know, like for some reason, everything's kind of like connects to that company. Like you're, you you'll have to do some more investigation to see if that's like public or something secret. But for some reason, you're seeing some connection between this awesome. building and Helix Labs. But as you turn around back to like the actual building that you're going up. The floor before you get up, you see a silhouette wearing a trench coat and a hat. And you see that for just a moment before the elevator gets to the top floor. You blink your eyes. You weren't able to catch her face, you just saw the silhouette, they didn't look like a construction, and then you see uh, all, that's, <laughs> all, that, all that's wiped from your head as you see uh, Logan. David and Goliath yeah. staring each other down. Yeah, like Donald is, uh, Donald, this huge dude holding this giant fucking sledgehammer is looking down at Logan, and he does not have a good look on his face as you guys step off the elevator and you hear Donnie go, oh, hey, that, that, that's where your friend is. Uh, it's, uh, sir, sir, it's, it's great to see you. Uh, I, I need to bring you out the, of the uh, construction uh, site with uh, the rest of your, uh, your crew. Sir, are you still holding on to his construction hat? Oh yes. <laughs> he, he, when he walked away, the hat came off. Yeah. Like, <laughs> yeah, he, sir. <laughs> Sir, uh, I'm just shooting. <laughs> <laughs> and then he like, just By the way, now he's just like. <laughs> do I, I? I'm seeing him like. Yeah. Uh, you look up and uh, yeah, you you immediately catch like this dude is as big as you. Uh, as, but is he still like like is he like towering over? Yeah, uh, yeah buddy. Yeah, so I mean, he's like. <gasps> yeah, uh, Donald. Friendship. Don looks up and goes, "Oh, uh, they're with you." Yeah, uh, I would not ever like lose his ass. Like, yes, to the people who help me to, uh, look over buildings. This is the gentleman I was telling you about. And like, I kind of walk <laughs> up to him and like, and like, I'm crushing the hard hat. And the hat <laughs> oh! is what you were doing? Yeah. Uh, Donnie is like, he's just like holding his head that doesn't have a hard hat anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so, <laughs> so, so you could have been. Really so, so I'm not allowed to walk around. Hey, I, just, I, would like I just, to be cool. I just like push this. Like I put the, I, yes. like you know, like, like, like I make him grab the hat, the broken hat, it's all in pieces, and I just keep walking towards that guy. <laughs> what were you gonna do? Oh, I was just, I just wanted Spot to be growling just yeah. while all this was going on. The spot, all three of Spots. <laughs> How tall is um, what's the gentleman's name? Donald. Masterson. How tall is he? I'm six Masterson. five. Uh, is he seven five? <laughs> yeah, he's he's like six seven. 
like so how, how, I, I originally, man. how I originally like, envisioned him was just this like fucking brick wall of a dude uh, and you you walk up and he like for, for a moment you get that weird experience of like I'm looking uh, yeah, I'm looking. <laughs> <laughs> this is new. <laughs> I just got uh, Logan. Logan's right next to me, then, right? Yeah, right, Logan's right next to you. Because I'm getting like in his face. Yeah, you get in Donald's uh, face, and Donald's being like, "Whoa, uh, all right, we don't, uh, we don't need to do that now." Logan, there's a problem here. Uh, and I look, I look over to Lee, and I say, "Well, this individual is posing a possible uh, lawsuit to the the building and to everyone's lives here." And uh, as you can tell by that very nice looking sledgehammer. I just want to take a look at it, but he refuses to cooperate. And I put my hand on him, and uh, right by his shin, I get yeah. somewhere <laughs> I can reach it. Uh, and I'm going to use uh, Dwarven Runes on him. Oh, what, yes. what specifically are you trying to do here? Uh, I am going to give him... Uh, the power of everything. The power of God. <laughs> oh, wow. Uh, I'm going to instill on him um, the rune of uh, Mjolnir's strength. Oh, the Slayer of Giants. Oh, on Leland? On Leland. Oh, okay. I thought you were yeah. talking about Donald. I was oh, like, no, 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 no. That. I'm going to make this harder for us. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. So, uh, okay. <laughs> uh, so, yeah, uh, like, as he just like, this is my, the guy I was telling you about. And as he come close, poof, and uh, I, I activate it to draw the, the same runes that are on his. Give me um, a, uh, a change to game to help out your So, path. I'm going to use uh, Runic Enchantment. Uh, ward it to last, so make sure, like, I'm gonna show you what a real fucking room looks like. And, um, an eye for detail, to be sure that I'm putting in a place where he cannot see. Okay. So that's gonna be plus three. Six, ooh, man, that was bad. Nine. Oh. Not bad. Well, yeah. Good. Yeah. I know, it's because I, I rolled a six. <laughs> uh, so nine. Alright, that was, uh, three tax you said? Yes. Okay, so, uh, yeah, you can just give him, like, the older strength three. Uh, and you feel like, because this is not the first time I've, I've juiced you up, yeah, yeah, you I know. <sighs> like, I can yeah. feel it rushing through me right now. So many veins Now, uh, since you rolled a nine, just so you're aware, um, this is, like, you're you're doing this, like, real quick. So, like, as much as you'd like it to be built to last, you don't have that option. Uh, so this is this is going to be, like, a one and uh, like, uh, hit him yeah. real hard. Uh, and now that you have status, we're gonna use our handy dandy track tracking cards. Yay. Almost said that, right? I'm gonna show the key. You sounded so honest. Oh, great. Like, no, 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 I really was happy about it. Do you want yeah, me to show the, uh, the camera? Yeah, show the Do camera. the beauty goo. Yes. Yeah, these new put tag cards. So, what is it? Status one? Uh, uh, status three. It's gonna be out of focus, <laughs> dude. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know. It's gonna sell so somewhere there. You got Pablo. Get all the cameras. 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 Get all the Chris, you got clear, it. clear. Bring it. What the fuck was this? Here at Alu, here at Alu, you we don't care them. about your coworkers' safety. <laughs> <laughs> Ow! You, you, you come at your own accord. Should have worn a hard hat. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so again, okay. uh, you, you, you've, you've, hung, so you've hung around with Logan enough to know how this feels. But Logan does. Uh, he like touches the back of your like very muscular uh, leg uh, and inscribes like. The back of the leg, uh, the Mjolnir runes, and you feel that same sense of yes. like energy like coming through you. Um, like I said, you can feel this as like a oh, this, this doesn't have like the same control that Logan uh, usually has. That said, does Leland give a shit about that? No. Awesome. <laughs> um, so you start getting fired up as Donald also starts getting fired up and looks at you and, and goes, I'm oh, hang on, hang on. I, you, I don't recognize you. And also, and he looks down at your coat. Uh, I'm, uh, <laughs> actually, no, did you take off the coat when you walked in? Okay, he, he looks down at your coat, very fluffy, and goes, uh, no, that's not good for workers. And also, you two are not construction workers, so if you're with them, uh, how are you an engineer here? And I show him the papers, just like, are you questioning my credibility and my science and my work? You're the man. Over there. I mean, you you've got the the blueprints, but these are also like blueprints that. Oh yeah, like, not, yeah. Well, not, I don't think this man can read this yeah. kind of crap. Fuck that. Yeah, you're you're just like throwing up the yeah. blueprints, and he's just like looking at. It. He's he's 
he's like starting to see the situation. He looks up and goes, Can I put my hand on the hammer? On the grip, on like the part of the hammer? Yeah, I'm gonna do it. Oh. I'm not afraid. Oh! He's like, I just grabbed like, you're the man. Donald, see the hammer. Donald starts to turn to Don. Like he's, he's halfway through saying like, Donnie, who are? And then you put a hand on his hammer. Oof. Everything stops. Donnie? Completely silent. Uh, I realized that name. I was waiting for you. Yeah. I was going to say something earlier, but Don, Donnie, the sorry. scared yeah. construction yeah. worker, about is that. silent. Little D. Donald Masterson. Uh, uh, just call him Masterson. I'll just call him yeah. Masterson. That's there better. You go. Uh, That's more, th- more threatening. Yeah. Ma- Masterson uh, turns and like he slowly turns his head, <laughs> and you, you, you can almost hear the sound of like mm-hmm. granite like crumbling mm-hmm. against each other as he looks at him goes. Get your hand, respectfully, off my property. Give me the hammer. And we're just, yeah. we're, we're like this right now. I'm, I'm, still like, like, I'm not letting go. I uh, mean, while I'm down there, his eyes are out there, I, I slowly reach for my gun. And I'm like, I'm like kind of pushing low. Yeah. just slightly yeah. behind me, yeah. like, get behind me. It's about I, to go down. I don't know what exactly where we're standing, but as this tension happens and there's like white noise, I slowly like step in front of Corey. <laughs> <laughs> just a little bit, just like. <laughs> this could like be bad. Um, what is Spot doing? Um, Spot, well, he he would be probably right next to you. He would have moved forward as well, growling like everybody. Everybody's getting yeah. in position. Yeah. I'm just like, yeah, I'm ready to grab my gun. Everyone's slowly getting in position as the two yeah. biggest What's people Donnie in the doing? room. Do- Donnie <laughs> is stepping back, and he stepped back so much that he almost falls off. The oh my god, oh, poor Donnie. Corey takes a slow drag of the cigarette in the silence. He's like, be careful, Donnie. <laughs> <laughs> It's about to go. You don't want to meet my husband too soon. (laughs) (laughs) So yeah, we're we're gripped on it. Uh, Donald looks at you, and as he's staring you, his eyes slowly start to glow as he says, Uh, (laughs) I tried to be nice about it. And in one movement, takes the sledgehammer and swings it at you, going full, fu- you see, like, full lightning electrocuting from it. I'm going to need a face danger from you, bud. Ooh. All right. Doesn't he have to break the grip since they're, like, pretty much... Or, is it, same or is it go toe-to-toe? This, this, this is, this is part of, like, the face okay. danger is that he's able to, like, uh, okay. yeah. The face, okay. This broad face danger is just what does he do to avoid getting oh, hit? Oh, God. For initiative, so, I rolled a... Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, that's a okay. <laughs> Should I actually take it and absorb it? Like, withstand the blow? If you have tags for doing that, yeah, that's what face danger so is. So could man. I use... Wait, where is he striking me at? He's, he pretty much just has, like, taken it, and he's just doing, like, a full swing towards your side. So about right here? Yeah. yeah. Where the code is. This is an immortal... This is an immortal weapon shit. Can I use invulnerable coat? Okay. The strength of Hercules. Okay. <laughs> tough as nails. Okay. Oh, nice. Jesus Christ. And this is what he's yeah, got. No, I love it. I love it. I love it. Wow. <laughs> toughest guy in town? Do you have toughest nails and toughest guy in town? Yeah, I do. I'm going to say toughest guy in town is more of a reputation. Got it. Okay, there. okay. No problem. Why do you have He's know? about to know. No, because no, one is for physical combat. The other one's for intimidation. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Can I use facial scar to scare him? <laughs> then, once again, this is just. I got uh, a scar running down here. I've seen things. Once again, I mean, this is straight up taking okay, the blow. Okay. So, no. Yeah, yeah. Can I use eye for an eye for my, my retaliation? Ooh, uh, I'm going to say for the next move. This is you defending. So I got three, and I want to use that, and I'm also afraid what will come about it. What's the weakness time? It's uncontrollable rage. I don't know if that's... We'll, we'll see yeah, We'll see okay. if that comes I'll up. use three. I'll use three. So All right. vulnerable coat, strength, strength of Hercules, tough as nails. Can I use fire resistance because of whatever the lightning's going to do in terms of burning? It didn't melt shit. Yeah, this is a real hot attack. So yeah, fire resistance will save a little more. Nice. <laughs> Four, five, six, ten. Five, ten, ten, baby. There you go. <laughs> it, just, it, just, it just goes like this. Just... So wait, <laughs> can he <laughs> hit me? I'm so proud of you. And I just like, like just that, but I stand my ground. I didn't move. This is like a PDP kind of roll. Like the coat absorbed yeah. most of it. The, the hammer swings and hits you on the right shoulder. This, Leland... I'm gonna tell you this personally. This hurts. Okay. Not in a way that's like injurious, but in a way of like like someone tackling you. Like, got it. Fuck. That said, your coat 
shines gold and strengthens <laughs> at the last yes. minute as the nice. hammer hits against your shoulder and you guys hear another thunderclap and you see like a bit of the I flame have. like get onto your fur before the uh, before the flame snuffs out and your fur is not even like yes. damaged Ooh. and Do- uh, M- Masterson takes the sledgehammer and like takes a step back kick him off the building as he, lo- <laughs> as he looks at you and goes what are you? My turn. <laughs> I cock my, right? my fist back, and I'm gonna hit him so fucking hard in his jaw. Is your hand? Oh, the hand jaw can knock the person out. Easy. No, he took the hammer. That's why. So he, like, oh, he pulled the hammer back. Right right this me, one right here. But I didn't move. Sends the I just went like back like forth. that. Yeah. Okay. And now it's my turn. Go so, for it. So I'm gonna use strength of Hercules. Okay. I'm gonna use toughest nails. My fist. Eye for an eye. Uh, take out tough as nails. Oh, I got uh, That's it. more, yeah. Well, no, 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 I mean, you don't have to burn it. I'm saying okay. don't use that for the roll. So that's okay. three. Three. And you still have Mjolnir. And I have the Mjolnir. Yeah, you can use, you can burn, you can use I'll all use the that. Mjolnir. Four, okay. Four. Nice. No, that's three. Didn't you say toughest no. guy in town? My maybe? fist, his face of Hercules. Of Hercules. And then an eye for an eye. eye. An eye for an eye. eye. That's what I'm going Mjolnir. Mjolnir, you did a three status because you put three tags. Oh, so it's six. Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna fuck him up. That's a, that's a plus so I got plus six. Now, uh, just for aesthetics, plus since six. I didn't add the electrical outlet of you mm-hmm. know Mjolnir's electrical you know, vision. And okay. I use uncontrollable rage. Yes. Yeah, uh, but I use both so, my so five. Uh, so five. <laughs> uh, I want the, the visual as his face is coming up. Oh! <laughs> no, <laughs> no, get out of here. Um, I want the like the, the room shine mm-hmm. and just Not like the camera the follows Sorry. the veins coming from the room in like his entire body and his muscle just slightly gets a little. Can the bigger. muscles glow? Oh, yeah. Yeah. If, yeah. I mean, can the uh, the veins glow? Because that'd be sure. really cool. Yeah. Remember, I have the coat. So you, <laughs> remember, wait, okay, you yeah, I have glow. the coat. Yeah. <laughs> oh, I'm right. sure he has a coat on. I have the coat on, so you can't uh, see it. But all you can see is the. Well, you still see your veins. Yeah. yeah. Glowing. So, you're good. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So what's your total? Fourteen. Fourteen. All might punch. Yeah. <laughs> All might. One punch, man. Yeah, one punch. One punch. And oh, this, is, this is with your uncontrollable rage. Yeah. We can stack. Okay. Yeah. So, you just here's, here's what we're going to do. What do you want to do with this? You just want to hurt him as much as possible? What do you guys think? Should well, I just hurt him so fucking We don't hard? know that he's a bad guy. I mean, I, well, I, I mean, he did just took his hammer and swung we it We just him. need this hammer because this is what's caught. This is essentially what we're here for. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So it looks like we're going to need to get that item and take it back home. So that's what we're trying to do. Yeah. Okay. So he, then he did strike first. Yeah. 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 He did strike first. Here are your, here's sort of your options, like gameplay wise. Okay. Uh, like, Taking, you know, like getting out of the way of his counter strike. Um, you can also hit them and do more damage. Uh, you can control the collateral damage. Although I, I think I'm gonna have to strike that as an option just because you use uncontrollable rage as a weakness tag. Uh, hold the target's attention or uh, gain the upper hand, take one juice. Which for this situation would be like you hold on to one uh, bit of the Mjolnir juice. Mm-hmm. I feel like yeah. you, you probably want to like mess up his head so you can try to take the hammer from him. Like so if, if he loosens mm-hmm. his grip from being like ah, you know. So I, I'm gonna, I want this as a be a group thing because mm-hmm. what I'm about to do it's about to it's, it's about to go down. It's about it's about to go down. Yeah, yeah. yeah. We, there, there ain't no avoiding this fight now. We're 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 in the shits. <laughs> I, I I like that sound of that last option where you. What was it? Something about one juice. Take a juice. Yeah. yeah. The other thing about you, you hold up. Basically, you're charged with like Mjolnir stuff, and so like all three would be burned. But if you take the take one juice option, you can just retrofit that as you hold on to one uh, charge of the Mjolnir juice. But you also get a level up or dust. There's well, this, else okay. Wait, I burned all my. T- I burned all three of those. No. Oh. Let me start over. Oh. When you do hit with all you've got, mm-hmm. if you get a full over ten success, you can choose two options, which are the options that I said before, and those are basically like little extra effects to like your damage. You still punched him, and you're still gonna do how? How many tags? Was Fourteen. It? Oh, four. Uh, four tags. Four tags. Four tags. Four tags. Yeah, you're still gonna be doing a stat, a four status go. You're still gonna hit him real no, fucking five. Hard. Yeah, it was five plus yeah. five. Oh yeah, so you're still gonna be hitting him real fucking. And he's also thinking about his job security. Because so. <laughs> I also got those thing on. Right. Yeah. So. How about this? Do you want to hit him real hard and upgrade that and also keep some of your Mjolnir juice? Yeah. Cool. I, I like Sounds that. Sounds good. Okay, so change your... Uh, I've already put your, the attention on uh, Demigod's ring. Cool. And your uh, status card, wherever you put it. Where'd right. you put it? I gave it to you. Right, there you go. Yeah, just uh, erase that to one. Good. All right, cool. You guys see Leland 
his leg light up, and you see that light shoot up his body. You can barely see it through his clothes, but you can see the muscles in his arm grow to like insane proportions and also glow slightly. As smash. punch for punch, he <laughs> just hits oh, Donald in him. the chest. Oh, and with all no, no. It was in the face. Oh, in the face. Oh, he's, <laughs> he's gonna knock him out. He's trying to knock him out. Yeah, I went like yeah. this. Slow motion, you yeah. see like his jaw and like a single tooth like, uh, like fall off. <laughs> and you also see the energy, your own electrical blast shoot out from your fist as you hit this guy with all you've got. So that is... Uh, we just could the total I got was fourteen. <laughs> okay, so that that is going to be that would be a uh, hit a tier five status because of all the tags you roll. So normally that would take out anyone, but as Donald gets uh, Masterson gets shot back, he hits against a girder hard enough that it bends. Ooh, and you see him, like, his jaw's broken as he lands on his feet, sledgehammer's still in hand, and he takes his jaw, and he uh, uh, cracks uh, it back into place. Uh, I'm not healed, he just put it back in his yeah, socket. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna tell you this right now. Uh, Donald, uh, Ma- Donald Masterson, uh, Masterson, Masterson, I, 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 yeah, I can't say exactly. Don, 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 Don. Masterson. Masterson. Yeah. Donnie's gonna die, like, yeah. he's, <laughs> he's in the kill zone right yeah. now. He's gonna be like, Donnie, he Donnie. sees too much. Yeah. Donnie, you're joining our crew now. <laughs> the vision I have uh, is gonna come true right now. <laughs> I still have to steal his <laughs> Masterson. Leland, you know how much, like, damage you should have given him. Uh, Masterson has an ability called Invincible. Fuck. When Masterson takes a physical or subdual status, Reduce its tier by three. Oh. You have given you with your the the amount that you hit him, you only gave him a bruised two status. Wow. You hurt him. So is, is this like a passive effect? The, yeah, the, he's that you see the him hold fuck? you you see this guy for some reason while holding this hammer is tough. He gets back to his feet. And the hammer is well, no longer a nerd. <laughs> you see the electricity start to arc from it. The runes are like full glow as Masterson looks up and his eyes, no longer pupils. It is just full glow with like bits of electricity sparking out. Leland, you gave, the, you hit this guy as hard as you fucking could and he's still up and the rest of the crew, you see that and instantly realize just how bad of a situation you're all in <laughs> right now. One last thing. Mm-hmm. Leland, uh, you didn't choose to control the collateral damage, mostly because that wasn't an option. That's not what you're going for at all. Uh, you guys are in an active construction site, so oh. as that huge thunderclap hits and bits of electricity spark everywhere, you guys hear, oh, and you look up and you see that like the floor above has like cracked from the impact, oh. and uh, the ceiling collapses on you guys. I'm gonna need every person here to give me a face danger to avoid the falling debris. Okay. Take, uh, you want to take turns? Yeah, go. Uh, let's. Uh, why don't you guys start? Because I haven't right. done a Do first. Yeah. There you go. Um, I'm going to go first. 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 I'm going to go but it's not common. How about, you, this? You, How about you guys are at the top floor of the building, not the like top, top of the building. There's still like beams, okay, so there's, there's all kinds of just like they would not be so there's, okay, there's also all kinds of stuff like construction okay, I, stuff. I, I, like I was gonna, gonna really say, weird. why don't just the floor run goes down? I mean, just just roll face danger. <laughs> Right, so I'm gonna use you guys don't have to question everything about my hero. Oh yeah, no, that's right. This is the question. Did you not learn season one? Yeah. <laughs> oh Mystery game, uh, that's right. I'm gonna use invulnerable coat and uh strength of Hercules. Perfect. Okay. Tough as nails, dude. Oh, yeah, tough as nails. That's perfect. All right, tough as nails. Yeah, perfect. Literally, it's yeah, perfect. Yeah, literally. Here we go. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Okay. Uh, you're going to take one. Do we keep getting ones out of our rolls? Mm-hmm. All right, you're going to take a uh, tier. So that's going to be a minus one to the tier. So you take a uh, head injury, too. Okay. Do you have another sharpened card? Oh, yes, I do. There are a bunch of them right here. Here's a pencil. Actually, I think you're supposed to use um, erase wall markers with these. Probably. I'm, at least, are those not erasing We're one? On a budget. No, they're not. Okay, in fact, well, they're, they're imprinting on them. They're imprinting on them. Okay, <laughs> well, we will mess with that later. Do you know how many markers? They're all dry. <laughs> well, we'll find some. Anyway, uh, Pablo. I'm going to use shape shifting and jack of all trades for my football days, high school. That's right. 
And uh, she... allowed one broad tag in this game. <laughs> <laughs> That's part of the rules. You're allowed one shape. broad tag. And shape shifting because I'm gonna turn into I'm trying to think of a fast, shifty little animal. A fox? I, yeah, I was thinking that. Yeah, I'm gonna turn into a little fox okay. and 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 serpentine out of the way. Okay. The serpentine comes from the jack of all trades. Here we go. Tell me that's a set. So one, that's a three, it's a plus a two, it's a five, it's a five. It's a five? It's a five. Uh, you turn into a fox to try to get out of the way, but a bit of debris falls right on your head. Take, uh... Ha-ha! <laughs> 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 I'm a fox now! You're <laughs> 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 like the coyote in Looney Tunes. Fucking wildly. Uh, yeah, take uh, head injury three. Gory. Okay, um, so for this, I'm going to say uh, Spot is going to try to protect me either, like, uh, shoving me out of the way. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, basically, yeah, just shoving me out of the way. Um, so I'm going to use Infernal Guard Dog and Undying Loyalty. Okay. Do you want to use Death Sense on yourself to see what's going to happen in a void? I think because this is happening so... Oh. <laughs> I don't know. Well, it's happening really fast. You know, I feel like... You can make the argument. I'm just saying. No, I agree. What, I, can we... what is the tech? Death sense. So he was he was suggesting, what if I use death sense on myself to see if that could help me avoid? Hmm. Kind of like final destination. Yeah, I'm gonna say that 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 makes sense. You're also okay. like you sense someone in the room, like their death, and like you know if they die here, their death's about to change. So yeah, I'll say that. Okay. So thank you, thank you. Yeah, I you just... you feel Donnie's uh, do, fate do. change <laughs> in front of you when you realize that something bad's about to happen. Okay, so, okay. okay. So death oh, sense, what? infernal guard dog, and untamed right. loyalty. Oh. That's a five. Damn! 11, 11, 12, 13, 14. Yo! Wow! Yo! Yo you gotta get new the dice. Baroness These are not even my dice. Like, yeah, didn't she take his or hers? <laughs> you know, yeah, I yeah. did take yours, and this is my karma. Corey, Corey, you look toward Donnie, and for just a moment you see the vision, not of him, like, you know, uh, ahead in his career and then a tragic accident, but him, like, falling off and, like, dying right here. And I closed it earlier! Yeah, I know. Yeah, you, you turn right to Donnie and you, like, see the you. You, you just, like, grab him, like, push him out of the way right as, like, some rock, like, falls right down. <laughs> <laughs> you know what's funny? That's your reaction when yes! there's I called it early. I called it early. <laughs> <laughs> I told you. So even as he was pushing me back, I was already reaching for my gun. So I'm going to shoot up at anything on top of me. <laughs> yeah. Wait, okay. what? Yeah. Just shoot I'm going to just shoot back. Shoot the rock. <laughs> Let's do it. Yeah. Okay. So I'm going to use an eye for detail. Shoot oh, yourself. Where, like, <laughs> that would suck. An eye for detail. Uh, my yet-to-be-named gun, but I'm going to call it by the profession, the possessions logo of my Magnum Dog. Um, and uh, specialty ammo, which I'm going to turn into high explosive. Okay, I'm going to say not eye for detail, just because that's for, like, you know, looking around and actually, like, taking your time with stuff. This is like, oh shit, gotta do something immediately. First, oh. first thought in your head is shoot the rock above you. Yeah, alright, so just plus two. Yep. Uh, eight. Eight. Okay, uh, that's minus one to tier. You, uh, you shoot some rock, but of course, like, some debris still manages to hit you. Uh, take bump on the head, too. Okay, so. What does he do? Uh, you fucking die. He just, he just holds up his sledgehammer. Like, literally, he just holds up the sledgehammer, a rock, like, hits it, and then, like, some lightning just bursts and just <laughs> destroys the rock. Yeah. There is now no roof above you guys. The whole storm is above you now and starting to swirl ever so slightly and the Metal. building shakes and you look around and you see just how much damage Leland did in that because that was that, that was a big punch you <laughs> see just how much collateral damage he did to this place <laughs> <laughs> I'm so proud of my work <laughs> I yell out He's see I told you you're a hazard the moment <laughs> Not to you, Tiffany. I know, that's... <laughs> <laughs> <Look at this. laughs> the moment you guys realize that this building, one more hit like that, or any really, like, big hit, is going to not send this whole thing going down. You also see uh, Masterson apparently uncaring about that as his eyes are still glowing and he's still stomping, like, fucking serial killer stomping, toward Leland. And there's one more thing. Donnie. <laughs> you better not end the episode this album. Turns fuck is it to Hydra. Hydra. Fuck is Hydra. <laughs> uh, Marty. 
you see that figure again. Oh, fuck. That silhouette off in the distance. I turn back into me. Yeah. Yeah. You turn back into you, you see that figure, and then right as you, like, there's a moment where you change, and, like, your your fox eyes turn back into human eyes, and you look, no one there. Did you truly see that? Um, As Donnie walks up to you, the floor shaking underneath him as he goes, all right, last warning. This is my hammer. This is my sight, and this is my job. So if you want to get in between me and my job, shoot him in the mouth. <laughs> <laughs> There's gonna be no monologuing in this, but us. England. <laughs> But no, I'm just fucking with them. No, 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 do, do it. it. Do it. Do it. Do it. Do it. No, do it. Okay. I want to wait. I just want to get a laugh. Leland, that was great. Leland, before you can raise your fist, Marty and Corey, before you can do anything to defuse this weird situation that oh, you're like this. just forgetting at the buzz. <laughs> you see Logan. I, I, I imagine there's a bit of like, oh, you're going up against my boy. Uh, yeah. And you pull out your gun. No one touches my man. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to need a. Not real quick. I'm going to enchant my gun. Is that two separate rolls to enchant it and then fire? Yes, that's two separate rolls. It's also gonna take you a moment to like enchant your gun. So like if you wanna shoot him now in this moment, that it's it's gonna have to be now. Otherwise you can enchant your gun, but like that's you know, that, that's gonna take you a few seconds. So okay, just for clarification for future events. If I were to like like I did with with uh, with Leland, you know, put a rune on it, mm-hmm. how long does that usually take? For you putting a rune on things, like I imagine it's just like a few seconds since it's like mostly magic and all yeah. that. The the main thing here is that the situation is so like every second counts that like you spending those few precious seconds to like enchant your gun is a second that Masterson or Leland has to throw another punch. Okay, okay, got it. Okay, this is uh, the question the reason I answered was something later on I'm gonna yeah. do. But for this, okay, I'm not gonna enchant my gun then. Cool. Uh, yeah, I'm shoot him. I'm gonna shoot him in the face. Yeah. <laughs> uh, so I'm gonna use a gun and a specialty ammo. And I'm gonna go with uh, flare to blind it. All right, because you may be a god, but that still doesn't protect your eyes. So plus two, seven, barely fucking this. Man, Logan. You pull out your gun. Oh, as, already out. Yeah, it, it's it's all oh, right. You just shot yeah. twice. <laughs> you have your gun. You do just you, you take one moment to like switch the ammo and you point it at Masterson. And you firefly. <laughs> the hammer instinctively jerks towards you, and Masterson's eyes go from Leland to you as you show the most uh, like as you show the most threat in this moment. Uh, with here's the deal. In this next moment, Masterson is going to like try to hit you for trying to shoot him. You can either, in, in this exact moment, shoot him and hit him and blind him, or get the fuck out of the way. Wait, so it's uh, you got a mixed success on hit with all you got. Sorry, not hit with uh, with uh, go to the toe. So with usually with go to the toe, it's uh, you have three options. Uh, oh no, 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 yeah, but he's within striking distance with him in the way. Cause yeah. I'm, I'm far back. Yeah, he's, if, he's shooting from a distance. Yeah. How is he going to hit? Yeah. Unless he's going to strike him with lightning. Or can he throw the hammer? Would that be it? Is that what you're thinking? Or? Yeah, he could yeah, do something like that. that. Okay, yeah. you know what? I want him to hit him because if I can grab that hammer, I'm going to disenchant it. Okay. Ooh. So you you shoot. Okay. I'm gonna see if I can hit him. All right. Cool. So uh, so yeah. So you already rolled, right? Yeah, I already rolled. Yeah. So yeah, it was yeah, a big yeah, success. Yeah. So uh, that was two two tags. Uh, yeah. Okay. So you we all put it down. You hit him. <laughs> uh, he takes a status blinded two. Uh, as uh, you were doing this strictly to like like fuck up his sight, yeah. and as he does, uh, he turns and even with his eyes like seeing more light than normal, he takes the sledgehammer and chucks it right at you. I'm gonna need a face danger. Yeah! <laughs> there it is. Wait, uh, could, could I not okay. interfere with it? Like, could I do something before he's able to throw it? Or no? Yeah, I was wondering if I'm seeing it, this go down. You're seeing, yeah, you guys are seeing all this go down, so. Uh, Can we intercept before the throw? Or the throw has to happen to do anything? Because you guys are literally right next to each other. Yeah, I'm a distance away. I'm asking you. Know, you. Uh, sh- 
Yeah, so normally that's there's like a special like theme improvement to okay. like you know get in between and like sacrifice yeah. yourself and all that. So like while we're playing at like level one right now, you guys don't have those abilities. Yet. Okay, okay, yeah. That's, that's, but that's a thing that exists. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Uh, sorry, um, I was gonna use my ability no. No. Sledgehammer being thrown at you. Like, what do you do? Let's see. Have a card. Uh, yeah, <laughs> like, <laughs> I forgot about that. Okay, um, given that, because you, you you limited my use of an eye for detail when it came to like shooting in the moment. Yeah, right. I see him like about to fucking throw the hammer at me, so it's not something like the the debris falling immediately on me. What I want to, I guess you know, put out there is, can I somehow like see as it's coming in and predict where it might hit me to try to dodge it a little bit? Yeah. Uh, for with eye for detail, yeah, sure. Okay, so this plus one. Okay. I'm gonna say there was like a genuine moment yeah. where you're like, either I'm gonna dodge yeah. this or I'm gonna. Because he has to wind back. He can't just yeah. go like. Yeah. Boom. yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Plus one. How much? Ten. <laughs> Ten. And a nine, and then one. <laughs> nice. Nice. We were talking about other things. <laughs> <laughs> so, he chucks the sledgehammer at you. And <laughs> Logan, you jump out of the way yeah. just in time yeah. for the yeah. sledgehammer to go right past you, past the floor, and start falling to the construction yard below you. And in that moment where you guys can almost hear the the foundations. Oh, fuck. This building, which was made to be fragile, is hit. And suddenly, everything starts to shake. And Donnie looks down and sees a very familiar girder right below him. He goes, <gasps> We're all gonna die! <laughs> Donnie, no! no! That's where we're gonna end the no! session. For some, but oh. I cannot wait for next session. I cannot yeah, wait to see that how you guys are flying. Yeah, I thought he was gonna make a grab for it. There, there, yeah. There's no possible way for, especially <laughs> someone of yeah. Logan's stature. This is this is also like a full like long handle sledgehammer being thrown. Like there is a momentum there. Say, oh no, I wanted to grab it and get thrown with it. <laughs> yes. uh, thank you all for coming to join us. Uh, tune in next session as uh, maybe our heroes all die and we just start a new season. We'll figure that out. I'm Marty Blanc, if you're not here. Lucky you! <laughs> Bye, everybody. <laughs> I'm going to use it that entire sentence. <laughs>